There are many primitives on the PCB, and there may come a time when we want to limit their selection to a specific type of object or objects. This can be done using the selection filter. The selection filter is located in the properties panel when nothing is selected, and it can also be found in the active bar. In it, we leave only those objects that we want to select and disable those that are not needed. This filter can also be used for the group editing of specific objects through the properties panel. In addition, the filter is useful at various stages of the layout process. At the component placement stage, you can enable the selection of only components. At the routing stage, leave only tracks, vias, and pads. When using the filter, do not forget to apply the single layer mode if necessary. The Properties panel also has a Post Selection filter. It applies to previously selected objects and allows you to show the properties of only a specific type of primitive for group editing. Remember to return the Post Selection filter to its original state. So that was a little bit about the Selection filter and how it can help during the layout process. Thanks for watching.